So, but I thought about it. I said, she got a point. We shouldn't talk about killing her son. It was funny. It was, well, it was funny. And it was, it <laughs> it was a good just, it was a good reason. It wasn't just a dude. But I was being selfish in my thoughts. Maybe she just wasn't ready to take that step. So I, I said to myself, I'm going I'm to I'm be a little bit more nice to Candy, maybe. You know what I'm saying? See how that nice shit feel. Uh, no, I was thinking of all the shit I would have did. Like I was picturing myself knocking over the. No, I'm just playing. Yeah, knocking over the mic. What the fuck you say? Uh, if no, just, if y'all talking about killing my son, we weren't talking about just going to him and shooting his face oh, for no reason. It wasn't a senseless crime. It was for, it was for a benefit. Fuck some insurance. Huh? It depends on how, it depends on how your pockets are. Yeah. At that point in time when we discussing it, it's funny when um, you talking about somebody else shit instead of yours. That's what I don't understand. So, so I'm talking about like if you say some shit about m- my child, it's funny. But if I say some shit about yours, then it's not funny. If That's I, what I understand about people. But it's funny to me if it's funny. It's only funny nah. Like if you dumb, you dumb. Mm. <laughs> No, I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was crazy. He's an idiot. <laughs> He's an idiot. Hey, oh but no, nah, like it was, it, it was, it was a joke. It was like a I really want to kill him for real, mm-hmm. unless I was hired. Is there a way for us? Because that's another thing that kind of annoys me. Is there a way for us to change so we can know exactly what we were talking about? Because I was like, I don't fucking know what date we was talking about. I just gotta go back things. and listen. That's that bullshit. Yeah. But 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 on some other shit though. Sorry. I'm being I'm changing. I told you I was nice early. I'm a nice guy. Yes. My my meanness is highly overrated. I fed at least six Africans on TV when Sally Strother asked me for my change. That fifteen cents. That's, that's all I was about to say. Wow, sixty cents all together. Uh-huh. <laughs> no, that's how I'd be, be asking for like fifteen cents. He said uh, he's I thought um, you said sixty something like that. Sixty cents. Yeah, that's some hungry he Africans. He, I don't fuck with them he hungry said Africans. He fed like yeah. six of them. So I'll about sixty. I tell them motherfuckers quick. You get one spoon. <laughs> you get one right. spoon for a motherfucker. Don't get over here showing out. You ain't never had no fucking spoon full of rice. Too slow. Yeah. Hell yeah. no. Yeah. You better mix it with them flies. Yeah. <laughs> See. You That's shouldn't laugh, up. but you can't have a laugh. Let's see, let's see your mouth <laughs> feed the children, man. I want to feed them. Why not? It was hungry people Shh. here. Oh, never mind. That is true. What's that? <laughs> What's, that? <laughs> What's that? What's that? Nothing. That's an African too. I'm saying, like you should, you should. <laughs> but it's healthy. Yeah, like all Africans are. Like, I ate my village. <laughs> but what's I ate but it. what's fucked up about it? My um son brought home an article and talking about how much food we actually waste. Yeah, we waste a lot shit. of food. Cause you know why? Then the same article that tell you over the course of your life you'll eat two hundred bucks when you're asleep. Somebody told me that you know when you sleep you eat six hundred bucks over your whole life. How do you know, you motherfucker? Sleep, I heard eating candy bars and shit just factories. Mm, I don't believe I don't be believing shit like that. You gotta prove it to me. I had to see it first. Yeah, yeah. I gotta see. I gotta see bugs flying. <laughs> why, why would you do a study on that? Though? All right, cause how figure, can you do a study and how many people to make Listen, it accurate to this, where? And this is some real shit. What the fuck she said? But people read this shit and be like, "Yeah, I'm smart. I know." Because they because you know you, you I go like, if you go to a lab and they push for sleep to run tests, they probably got bugs there. They gonna let call on you to see. Yeah. <laughs> See how many so, go in your mouth. Like, okay, he had a big old cockroach. He didn't wake up. He got cockroaches at his house. It's like, yeah. oh, man, so bugs and I got. If you grew up with roaches, you still never, you never become friends with roaches. You'll feel it. You will never be. Them no big ass roaches all style. You will feel them going in, in your mouth. You start playing with them. No, I went oh. to go visit. Oh. <laughs> me and my mom. Go ahead and shout them out. Shout, give them a shout out. Give them a shout out. I don't remember. Who had the roaches? Name. Who had the roaches? Nine. Who? Oh, had the roaches. Okay. No, it was in the projects of New York. Them roaches would not die. Like, spray them straight on raid. They keep I was just, like, just flew a building into their house. Man, you I know, into the house. I mean, playing with the roaches. Like, the roach was on the little fucking car, and he was like, Oh, uh, hell he no. Nah. That yeah. roach was having he fun. He probably dead now. Yeah. That roach was having fun. Right. Like, he he said that roach was on a little toy car, and he was playing. Yeah. That roach was like, What the fuck? He probably misunderstood. Nobody never got tried to get to know him. I'm living it up, bitches. <laughs> hey, ain't nobody never got to sit down and know a Rosie. Bros are probably good people. <laughs> <laughs> no, the fuck they not. That was back in the, that Joe's like apartment. Joe's apartment. Hey, man, I don't give a fuck. I, don't, I can't stand no nigga act like they ain't never slept with roaches. I don't like no uppity ass nigga act like they ain't never shared like an ain't evening never with a roach. roach. You ain't never roaches? Hell yeah! I I lived in the projects in Chicago. I've been I lived everywhere. I don't see some roaches and some mice. 
Yeah, cockroaches. Those white them New York. I, I saw a roach fly you know, before. Fly. Yeah, that's why. I, no, that's down south. No, it's I, white no, roaches too. I saw a roach. Yeah, yeah, I thought it had paint on them. I saw a white roach you before. It's white a roaches. white roach, yeah, like it's you, white. You like had paint on it. I thought, thought it did. Oh, I, said, it's a I ain't never seen no white <laughs> roaches. I think I saw no. I about Don't fly roaches roach. be the no ones. Oh man, I used me and my sister used to run out the fucking house. Man, you are. And this now is, I square up with the, the roaches. Up thing. This is the fuck the thing though. No matter how many roaches you had at your house, when you went over to my house, the roaches seemed just look <laughs> nastier. Yeah. Ugh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie. Looking around like we had all kind of roaches though. We had smell good roaches because if you couldn't find the raid. You sprayed them with uh, pressure. Yeah, man, I, used, pressure. Uh, I, I done tried to kill a roach with everything. Dude, furniture polish. Uh, <laughs> like I, done, I, I, hey, I, I spit on a roach and he stopped moving. I just kept spitting on him. Just kept spitting on him. Kept spitting on him. Yeah, I'm, bro. I'm, I'm a savage. I'm a savage. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm a savage. Oh, no. I'm a savage. I'm a savage. I'm a savage. You ever seen somebody roast at one time and make feel like they're crawling on you? Yes. That's called the willies. The willies. That's called the willies. Hell, I swear to God, I don't want to go my house seeing a roach. And they have some like good food. You, and I ain't never eat over there again. Nah, Hell no. Because we, we had our roaches shit. trained. You Y'all didn't come out doing dinner. You see the roach. <laughs> you see the roach. You got to act like you don't see it. Yeah, that's oh, all I was about to say. He getting super close to you like this motherfucker tripping. Oh, no. You know what's fucked up about that? When you at your own house and you see the roach, you go to the next motherfucker yeah, don't ever see it. Like, yeah, don't be on see Because you get to school, guess who got roaches? Uh, uh, I beat you. Hold on, hold on. I beat you in the spelling test. You got roaches. You brought it. <laughs> you brought <laughs> it to my I remember roach crawled out of a nigga's bo- uh, yeah, book bag one I day. That happened to me bag. before. You caught out your book bag? But the kids. Oh yeah, I'd have killed you. <laughs> no, they ah, thought Tramilla they blamed Moore. it on the dusty looking girl. They was yeah. like, I know it ain't come from her. Yeah, it came from her. And they blame oh. it, and I ain't say nothing. I was just like, bitch die. But I watched it crawl out of my book went, backpack. It, Hell I ain't yeah. say shit. I was you quiet. Shit, you know, I, I'm not about to take them. Um, that bullying. Because right. you know what? <laughs> if that happened in third grade, you got to deal with that till you out of school. Hell yeah. You got to deal with that till niggas want to be honest. Hell yeah. That's fucked up. Yeah. But yeah. Oh, uh, did y'all? Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I started thinking about being in school and kids again, but did y'all see that video from here that went viral? Like, she got like 9 million views off the girl, lady, lady who went off at Family Dollar about her kids. Uh, yeah, yeah. That was here. Yeah, that was here. I know the um, the chicks, the, the lady, her kids. 21st what happened? She went off. That shit was staged. Was. It was it, I feel like you like said you said Hillary Clinton had that seizure. Yeah, you don't believe shit. shit. No, because yeah. okay, you you claim your kids are wearing these African garments, but you come in there dressed like a normal yeah, mom. Like, she took. I felt like yeah, she took yeah. off her stuff no, just in case she had the scrap. Listen, 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 no, listen, 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 XO. That's how you sound. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, you ain't about to disrespect me like that. When you down for your culture, you're not gonna change just to go off. She would have went in there with an African garment on there, and she would have been dancing. But no, because I seen um, <laughs> pictures of her. Her kids is on my Facebook. Her daughter. Her daughter does music here. She, her no, her daughter um, is an artist. Uh, I thought she was a well known. Her name is Miss Parker. She I don't know her personally. Music. She don't. She don't. She rap. I think she sing too, but I'm not for sure. Or maybe she's singing. I don't know. But anyways. Um, she posted a lot of stuff. Her mother has a lot of pictures of her in the African attire as well. I could take a picture in the African attire. What's African attire? But I'm no, not going. They had on. You ain't African attire African unless you got some fucking. They you got some coming to listen, America. Bro. If you got, this is talk. African attire, the Africans I grew to know and love on Shaka Zulu. They wore. You gotta have a skull <laughs> on with teeth like all around your neck, like uh, like teeth of all the motherfucking warriors you killed from other kill. villages, and you gotta have on a dress, but it's not really a dress. It's a warrior's thing. But you gotta, but your ass gotta be hanging out. Gotta but you gotta have like a pouch over your dick. But so when you're running with your spear and shit, your dick is held down. Right. That's African garment. These are pseudo Africans. But I say that video too. But, but yeah, was, but the thing was, was, like, you know, that was it, it's about you don't say shit to people, kids. I feel like, I don't feel like she was wrong. So. Wait a minute, I don't know. Break it down for me though, because I don't understand what all happened. Wrong, but it was, I'm like this. If you say something about my kids, I'm not going to be that nice. She was nice. She just cussed her out. I'm like, ooh, my mama cussed me out. Ooh, keep it moving. <laughs> yeah, I, was, I didn't she, know why I went like, viral. She was like, like bitch. She, okay, a white lady at Family Dollar had um, some black kids came in, and she asked, are they going trick-or-treat? Trick or treat. <laughs> <laughs> That's some funny shit. 
Hey, hey wait, hold on. Wait, wait, I ain't hear this shit. That's some funny shit. Okay, they chicken chick. Oh, so the black shit. came in and went off on Bitch, you don't ask my, you don't ask my kids in yeah, do it look like my kids are going trick or treating? Well, yeah, I, it do. See, <laughs> that's, that's that. what I'm saying, like, uh, I feel like a black woman's always put in a different light, because just the way y'all was saying, um, how she was talking is not what I heard. To me, she sound very articulate. Like, yes, yeah, she had some cuss words in here, but she went like, yeah, y'all got my kids fucked up and talking about crazy like that. She was like, who the fuck? Where goes trick or treating in September? Like I don't feel like she was sounding ratchet or crazy or anything like that. You think she was ratchet? See, I think as a black woman, saying some cuss words, she's. Yeah, she should have. Yeah, yeah, bitch, if you have family down on twenty first of August and you ain't from Africa, shut the fuck up. Let's keep it moving. What? It ain't about being from Africa. It's about representing you. You. Africa. You a nigga. <laughs> That's some funny shit, though. It Are you going to the street? That's some, it, I wish I'd have thought about that. Like that Where you niggas going there? Hey, she, oh, yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I, I feel like it was staged. That's just my personal Dark, opinion. cool, <laughs> jiggaboo, spear sucker. Is that who you are? That's what I would have said. Uh, like what? <laughs> it's just one of them days, it man. Is. It's, it's just fucking out there. ignorant yeah. shit. Shit is not getting my fucking nerves. Hmm. Nigga shit, man. Yeah, it get on my nerves too. Uh, white people damn. do shit like that about niggas. It just, just but you know what I mean. So that shit made me feel? laugh. You know what? Put I just in her shoes. I don't know if I would have went up there and did all that, but I felt like um, she. I felt like she handled herself well because. <laughs> Yeah, because I don't want to hear myself. <laughs> but but um, the lady didn't lose her job. She's still up there. I talked to her yesterday. I interviewed her. The white lady. <laughs> no, fuck you, did. I, did. I, well, I, I, I went in there and interviewed. I go back. I go back there tomorrow. Why you didn't record, like, my phone the was thing, dead. Like I will go back. There, I will go up there tomorrow and, and interview her. I will interview her. And be like, look, I don't know your name, Miss White Lady, but that was fucking genius. How you feel? How you feel about asking kids in September if they go on trick or treat? Yeah. Niggas, I'm about to head of the curve. Why <laughs> going early? Hell, we sell Halloween candy. <laughs> Hell yeah. They would have some, what was it, candy corn? Candy corn. That was yeah. kind but of come on now. She knew they weren't going on damn trick yeah, or like, treating. She said she didn't funny. know what they had, had on, but it was, yeah, to me, it was clear thing. on what the fuck they had on, some African shit. I wasn't She could have said some shit like, what you going to do, sell your brothers? <gasps> <laughs> yeah. Then she probably would have got cut. You're going on a boat ride. <laughs> she could have said a lot of shit that would have dinged. You going to go on a boat ride? Your mother didn't do enough. They do her, her going off was really calm. She just said some cuss words. It's yeah, like, like she talked to the manager. It was, it was, phone, I, need maybe. To, I need to talk to a manager. You don't say no shit like that to nobody's kids. Who the fuck do you think? No, I'm like you. I would have. I, I would have knocked them chips. I would have knocked them chips over. I would have opened the bag up and I would have ate them as uh, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> That's probably some shit I would have did. I love chips. I'm not paying for these. I'm not, line, poor I'm right. not paying for these chips. Like now you go <laughs> trick or treat. <laughs> Since they going trick or treating, we want all this candy. I know that would have been. Go get you a twenty. Funny as hell if she would have did that. But then shit, the police. Fuck the police. Go ahead. Nah. But then I'm like, I'm just playing. I'm paying for it. You can't take shots. She just. She just. We all was clowning. We all been clowning since we got here. That's my nigga Becky. Really, Becky. You gonna lie on me like that? You was just. You was real at first. You know what I'm saying? You I should have knew that you was just going to act like white people when the white people came in. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. What's yeah, up, I though? Did not know that was I don't know. Yeah. I just feel like some white people they think they can say just just anything. Oh, they, they think it's, oh, they no. think no, it's, it's funny. No, no we're not all, just. All shit aside, though, they, they got it's, they a, it's an entitlement, and that's how it is when you're on top of the mountain. They can. Yeah, they do. It's, I mean, that's the, that's they say the. Shit and it, like I told you, like I, and you can identify with this. How many times they said, "Oh my God, I never." Can I touch your hair? Swear. Hey, hey, hey you know I, what? To go on that. Did you? And it's some goofy shit. Fuck that. that fuck that. What he say? This nigga gonna say in his thirty three years on this earth, he's oh, never he's never been a victim of racism. He didn't even know it still existed. <laughs> but then he do that whole. When well, you on drugs, you won't. <laughs> he said he wants to speak about himself personally. He this said he didn't a, know this. If I, I might not know something going on. Nah, he ignorant. Still, I'm like, really? If I don't know, understand why a nigga would say something yeah, like that. that. Was like I don't understand. You don't have to be. He it's not even you know politically what? correct. It's about being honest. And the crazy thing about it is, the white man he was interview Skip Bayless looked at him like. This motherfucker like, line, He fits the profile the of a I'm nigga saying, that I'm gets. A nigga now. <laughs> I ain't right. never, 32 years, I ain't never been a victim of race. Are you serious? 
And you a celebrity. You a celebrity. You smoke. Like, come on. Like, got dressed.